Hi, my name is Erica, and I'm a fitness trainer here at Mike Ortega's Health and Fitness Center. This is Becky, and she's a fitness trainer here too. Today, we're going to teach you how to do the MedX leg press. So, one of the things that has come to light over recent years is how the back should be positioned on the leg press. For years, we thought the further down it was, the better it was for the back. But now we do understand that for many people, it's actually better for it to be on the most upright position that puts the least amount of pressure on your spine. So that's why from now on you're going to see us teaching it here. To move it, there's a handle and then you've got the handle here and you're just going to move the seat up and down or the back up and down. Becky, have a seat, sliding your hips all the way to the back and you should feel that the pads are touching your shoulders but not jamming you in because as soon as your legs come up on the platform, you're going to feel that your shoulders kind of hitch up into those pads a little bit more. You want to make sure you can get um, range of motion. So I'm going to bring you in just a little bit closer to bring those knees in, closer to the body. And then you want to make sure that the knee is tracking, all, the knee is tracking along with the ankle. So all that's in line, that's going to help keep the shearing forces and keep the knees protected throughout the exercise. From here, I'm going to ask Becky to please just press back, uh, press out through your heels and then come back in again, nice and slow, feeling the effort on the um, glutes, the hamstrings, and a little bit on the quadriceps in this position. There are two weight stacks. The weight stack numbers should be equal. And then as Becky comes back in, we're just going to let her rest there. Handles are here for her to hold on. You can also hold on to the handles down here um, if you would like to. To get out of the machine, there is a handle off to the side that you can press down and then push back. And that's going to make it easier for you to get in and out of the machine. So some things to be aware of, if you are feeling any kind of back discomfort on this machine and you're not sure about your seat setting, make sure you come and see a trainer and we'll help set you up on it. If you're feeling back pain in the, in the higher level and you don't feel it in the lower level, perhaps we want to keep you on the lower level. Um, those are some of the things that you can discuss with a trainer as you're going through. This is an excellent machine to add to your program. We now have the leg curl, the leg extension, and then this will also add some extra um, strength to your legs if you would like.